I'm alive. Did you miss me? Yes, I love myself. I miss you. Do you guys remember her? My my OG subscriber. Do you hate when I say that? You're Peace right. out. Home slices. Your OG subscribers. Yeah, they miss hey, you. OG subscribers. We're, we we were never dating. We're just the three breast friends. Breast. Finally got done editing up the footage from this weekend. This lighting is always so terrible. But I realized that I didn't really vlog per se, but I did get some footage. So I thought I would just walk you guys through it since I already edited most of it up. Had a fantastic weekend. Honestly, it was awesome. It was cool to get outside of the city a little bit and go to another city, AKA Memphis. And yeah, so basically, let's see, where do we start? So Friday, AKA my birthday. Thank you to everyone who said happy birthday and left comments on that video that I put up on my birthday and Facebook and Snapchat and everything. Thank you very much. It was really kind of you guys to do so. 22, I'm just so old. <laughs> so my birthday, we left really early at like 7 a.m., drove through the beautiful state of Illinois, AKA a bunch of farmland. Semi quick, but it was it was it was long. What do I talk about? It was a long ride. So it was cool. So once we got there, we went right into the Airbnb that we rented. Right. Oh. I went with I guess nine other people. We ended up renting the Airbnb for like, I think I paid $133. Shout out to Juan's sister who set that all up. But it was really cool. It was like this little like apartment complex, but it was like condos on the inside and the ceilings were like at least like double or two and a half the size of our ceilings, if you can see. <laughs> they were gigantic, it was awesome. And basically Friday we just chilled all day. Juan and I worked out. Then we actually ended up going to Beale Street. We went to this like little cafe and they had a little, I think, local band playing and they were playing Purple Rain, aka my mom's favorite Prince, R.I.P. anything that night because I wanted to be ready to go for the moon pies deliciousness and yeah so Saturday was the competition headed to Bass Pro Shops and I've never been there before I've been to Bass Pro Shops but I haven't been there since I was a kid and this one was like a gigantic pyramid I've never been to Egypt but if you've been to Egypt I'm jealous that was really cool the inside there's all these like fishies and all that stuff it was cool and got to see Matt Stoney, he's a cool guy, really shy in person though, but cool guy. Um, and then we ate some moon pies. Delicious. I want you to know what a normal person can eat. And so I have asked two great team members of Bass Pro Shops to compete in an undercard event. And I've Three, two, one, go! Oh, what, what's the time? 1714! Oh, 1714! Men's souls, my friends, and they are right. For this is a battle for the ages. This is a battle of the titans, that being 
that is half God and comes to earth only once in only one location and that is here in Memphis, Tennessee at the Bass Pro Shops for only one purpose and that is the Moon Pie Eating Championship of the world. In her, nature has fashioned a warrior red in tooth and claw and her soul shines like magnesium set afire in the dark of a February night. She's from Westfield, New Jersey, elegance itself. Ladies and gentlemen, Sophia Davita! Ranked number 32 in the world. Record. Oh, he pointed it out just like Babe Ruth. Right there. Ladies and gentlemen, he beat Joey. The record here today, Matthew Stoney. Let's give him a round of applause. About eating. I was there when Joey Chestnut beat Kobayashi in 2007. I was there when Eric Badlands Booker first went to the stage in 19. Down from 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, That a girl, oh. Sophia, that a girl. Woo! Ended up finishing, I think it was like second. I got first for my gender, so number one. Just kidding, I was the only girl. But that being said, it was really fun. I, I do the competitive eating stuff for fun, so I enjoyed my time. It was cool going to Memphis, because otherwise, I would, why would I go to Memphis? But that being said, 25 in the books. I wanted to get over 20, so I'm happy with that. Uh, Stoney came in first with, I think, 85 new world record, as you saw. Uh, Carmen got, I think Carmen got like 73 maybe, I'm not sure, but he got second. Shout out to Carmen, he won his first uh, championship the past weekend at Bratz, but. Juan, how many did you eat? What's that? How many did you eat? 53. What Five. place did you get? Five. It was a really cool experience. I love doing eating competitions and stuff. And after that, we got to go out at Beale Street again. Really cool. I think we went to a karaoke bar. Welcome, ladies. Let's see if we keep this show rolling. We didn't get home till like, I think, five in the morning. And then we had to get up at eight or nine to drive back to Memphis. And now we're back home. Got a week of work ahead. And Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I know this is a little bit different, but I still hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you again for all the birthday wishes. It really means a lot. And stay tuned for the next video. I got some workout footage in it. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for support as always. I'll see you guys in the next one.